Culp Valley is located in the Anza Borrego State Park and it's considered one of the premier free camping locations in the park. While it's pretty primitive, it does have a bathroom and it does have some very nice secluded campsites and of course several really fun hikes in the area. To get there, you take the Montezuma grade, which is actually the S22. And to get to the start of our trail, we had to drive up around 3000 feet. We had hoped that it would be a lot cooler up there, but sadly we were mistaken. There are some tricky spots on this trail, so wear really good shoes or hiking boots. The presence of quartz like this indicates the presence of gold. So they told us there would be views. They're not kidding. If you look down there, the really dark green parts are the citrus fields outside of Borrego. The terrain here is pretty rough. Be prepared to hike on a whole lot of rocks and gravel. but the views make it all worthwhile. Taking a little shade break. Gotta get them when I can because my heart rate gets up there really high. And every once in a while, I just have to stop and let it slow down. Chinchweed, otherwise known as Pectus paposa. Rocks like these always puzzle me. Like, how did they get like that? You see cairns like this all over the desert, so I made my own. Hey there, we're stopping at the top of a bunch of switchbacks. We're at about 4,000 feet elevation. And I just want to talk a little bit about what we bring in our day packs. We like to bring, of course, snacks and lots of water. We have these smart water bottles which clip on and it's got a fast release thing, which is really, really nice. We bring our DJI camera, which is the coolest thing ever. <laughs> we bring our All Trails app. And what we can do is put things on airplane mode and that way we can know exactly where we are. A lot of what we bring is for emergencies. I've got a first aid kit, a space blanket to keep warm in case we get hypothermia, a rain poncho, I've got binoculars, cables for charging all of our stuff, and I've got this really cool charging brick which is solar powered. Got some extra cord in here. What else have I got here? A little lighter, just in case we need to start a fire for whatever reason. A compass, just in case our phone goes dead. That's nice to have. Sunscreen. Always take extra water. A bandana. An extra jacket, just in case. Lots of just-in-case stuff. A Sierra cup. And I keep a list here of all the things I need to have in here. And I always check the list before we take off. One of the best things that David and I have ever done is to start hiking. We've gone to so many interesting places and it's been a lot of fun. It's been really good for our health. I hope you enjoy coming along on these hikes with us and on our travels with us. And I hope if you'd like to see more content in the future that you'll hit the subscribe button and you'll give us a thumbs up and especially ring that bell because then it'll notify you once we have another video. So we'll see you on the next one.
Bye.